I'm going to tell you a story about what happens to little boys and girls who don't listen to what their parents and their teachers tell them to do. Let's find out what happens. If you're sitting comfortably, then I'll begin. Once upon a time, two sweet, innocent children strolled merrily along their usual path to school. The birds were singing, the sun was shining, yet old Bill's house still plagued the otherwise pleasant view. Every child in the village was forbidden to go near old Bill's. Even adults shuddered when they passed the house. As they approached the house, which was on their way to school, Peter and Nora felt an uneasy sensation bubbling in their bellies. What do you reckon, Nora? Peter whispered. No way! You know the rules! Nora could not believe what her brother was suggesting. Don't be stupid, Nora. You know it's not true. I'm going to knock on the door. Peter was up and over the fence like a cat. Nora scrambled after him in fear. The blackened door loomed over the small children. Peter slowly extended a finger and pressed the doorbell. A clanging chime of doom echoed from the other side of the door. The children jumped with sudden fright. Could they hear footsteps inside? They were uncertain. The house seemed empty. It certainly seemed empty to the two small children. Come on, Peter, let's go to school, pleaded Nora. As the children turned to leave, the door groaned and slowly swung open. They peered inside, their eyes adjusted to the gloom within. In the darkened hallway, barely visible at first, a figure stepped out of the shadows. <laughs> Join me tomorrow, where we will find out what happened in part two. Good night.